Well, the Crab Festival is back in St. Tammany Parish after two years away. The event kicked off today in an effort to highlight the North Shore. WDSU reporter Eli Brand is joining us live with a report on the work it took to get it back. Hey, Eli. Hey, Elizabeth. Well, organizers tell me it took a lot of work to get it back. They had to find food vendors. They had to find musical talent. But in the end, they say it was well worth it to bring the people of the North Shore back together. The prep work to prepare the festival's namesake. We have 1,500 pounds of crabs. All worth it for the people here, especially when it comes to getting the festival back on track. How's that look? Better? Andrew Kopfinger started his own seafood business, but just got the opportunity to be here for the Crab Festival. Opportunity presented itself and uh, just got into commercial fishing. My family does it. and uh, uh, The next step was starting a seafood market and uh, going from there. And Cop Fingers start is a comeback for the festival itself. Since 2019 is the first time doing it, man, and it means a lot to us. It means a whole lot to us because two year layoff because of COVID. Now you can see everybody's ready to come back out and party. And it isn't just crap here. It's music and other food. The dam, there you go. But mostly a reason to get together on the North Shore after a pandemic and always. Honestly, we've been missing it because we haven't had it for two years and it's always a good turnout. Like it's always nice. Like every year I've been, it's been nice. So we kind of been looking forward to it. You know what I mean? So I'm excited about today and tomorrow. I think we go turn out pretty good. The weather turned out nice. So I think we in here. If you missed the festival today and want to catch it, it will be going on tomorrow at Slidell Heritage Park. Gates open at noon. Reporting live, Eli Brand, WDSU News. Elizabeth.